Hi again everyone, Ralph Garifano, PGA Golf Professional here at Hunter's Run. We're going to talk about a pitch shot today. I know we went over that last year in one of the tips, but I have seen a lot of people struggling with this shot. We've chosen a spot here where we have a bunker in front, an elevated green, and not a whole lot of room to work with. Okay, so we're going to talk about some of the elements of pitching the ball and getting some loft. The first piece of this puzzle is understanding that we have to hinge the club on the way back to expose the bounce, expose the bounce. Many times we see people take the face back closed, as we can see in that shut position there, which has you doomed for digging the leading edge into the ground. So here, we're looking to get the face open on the backswing, a little bit of wrist hinge, so we're able to slide the club across using the sole should look like this pretty good shot right there again very important setting the face neutral to open a hair but again the big piece here is to hinge that club to expose the bounce okay here we are on the face-on angle. From the face-on angle, again, as we talked about from down the line, we're trying to hinge the club, expose the bounce. Here, I'd like you to see how much of a left-handed oriented brush this is. We see a lot of flipping and scooping, people desperately trying to add loft when there's no need to add loft. You have your lob wedge in your hand, we're going to set the club properly to expose the bounce, and we're going to try to just put both hands right over here. Just try to get both hands coming through together, not one hand dominating, putting both hands right there. A little bit of wrist hinge, boom. Same shot, you want to feel that ball jump in the air and it has a lot of spin on it right there. Good thing to practice, and it's hard to do, it's going to take some time, but practice pitching some balls with your left hand. I know I would mentioned earlier it's more of a left hand oriented shot. You should be able to pitch balls with one hand. If you can get the art of that, then you really got something. Again, hinging that club. Hinge it up there and hold that angle. Okay, in closing, super important not to get caught up in playing it way back in your stance and getting a ton of shaft lean on the ones we're trying to hit up in there. We want to let the loft work for you. So we're going to expose that bounce, brush, hold, have that face to the sky. We want to try to get some spin on the golf ball. There you go. Nice spin there. That ball's two feet from the hole. Perfect. Hope to see you guys on the short game area soon.